What's up guys, it's 4.30 right now. We're fixing to go saltwater fishing. We're super excited. We haven't been excited. salt. She's excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> we only got like an hour or two of sleep last night. She didn't get any sleep, I don't think. Uh, but we're fixing to go offshore. We hadn't been saltwater fishing in two or three months. So it's supposed to be warm today. It's supposed to be nice. We're trying to get out there and go offshore and catch whatever bites. But first, we need to get some bait from the bait store. All right, let's get some bait. Some Spanish sardines. There you go. <laughs> All right, now let's get to it. something with the eel probably rock bass yep rock bass blue. yeah it's a blue rock bass got a hump on him looks like a humpback grass <laughs> check that out It's like a black sea bass hump headed wrasse. Uh, they got to be 10 inches to keep. He might be 10 inches. Let's check him out. Ah, he's pushing it. Well, yeah. He's pretty. Yeah, he's 10 inches. We'll throw him in the cooler. All right, so we got some uh, shiners from the pond. And I'm gonna send them down. We're on top of a live coral reef right now. You can see that blue stuff right there. That's coral, that's live coral. And then you can see it. This is the um, chirp sonar, and this is the down imaging here. You can see those little bitty things coming up off the bottom right there. That's the live coral. But um, we're, we're catching little rock bass, and there's other little fish down there. So we're around live reefs. But I've got a five aught hook and this is 60 pound fluorocarbon tsunami leader and we're going to hook this pond shiner and send him down there and see if there's anything down there big enough to eat him maybe a big grouper or something will be down there big amberjack who knows as long as something tugs on my pole i'm happy put it in strike zone here Bought my live my dead shiner right here. Well, whatever it is, it must be big to get that shiner in its mouth. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. That rock bass isn't even as big as a shiner. <laughs> That's just nuts. That is nuts. We're going to go ahead and throw him back. So we're going to send my shiner back down here. Jackie's up there catching rock bass. Check out her little baby rock bass. <laughs> she had the bottom. Oh, shit. Oh, there it goes. Go for it. Start recording. Oh, whatever it is, this has got to be a big amberjack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Get the other camera. Holy cow. Oh, my God. Look at that! Huh? Look at that bull red! Woo! Oh! Oh, here's your bait. With a max L. That's the biggest bull red I've ever seen. Hang on by thread. Oh! 
All right, I want to stop this right here for just a second to point out that the hook just pulled out of his mouth. Now, my first instinct was to grab it, and the closest part of the redfish to me was his tail. Damn it! So <laughs> that was a big bull red. It counts. I touched it. <sighs> I know I wasn't filming. I couldn't gaff him. It's too big to keep. Then he come off the hook. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna get Amberjack here in a minute. Jackie's got a fish. She thinks she does. Yeah, she's got something. What you got on there? Oh, Jack Crabelle. No. That's a that's an Amberjack. Holy cow, an Amberjack. Get him in here. Look at that. Never saw one. Jackie called it Amberjack. <laughs> oh, well, and we released Amberjack. He was too small to oh, keep yeah. anyway. Yeah. All right, since there's some Amberjack down here, I'm gonna put my speed speed jig on. Well, actually, this is a butterfly jig. The only speed jig I got's about ripped apart. I might have to last resort to it. I am dying to catch me Amberjack. We're about to see. Something just grabbed it. Alright. What is this? I bet it's an amberjack. Yep. Reef donkey. So got a little amberjack guys. Fortunately they're out of season. So they're all gonna have to go back today. Get him on up here. That's a grouper! <laughs> Dang, look at that grouper. All right. So we got a grouper. We still ain't took the amberjack. Off the, he just wiggled off the hook, I guess. That's a big grouper. We're gonna have to let both these go because both of them are out of season. All right, Jackie just got his grouper. You ain't got the scale, do you? A bit wild, but. You know, I just, <laughs> and I just got his amberjack. There's something else on the pole. So we're gonna let these go. We can catch whatever it is on the pole. There goes Amberjack. And uh, here goes the grouper here. Red grouper. Check that out. <laughs> we we're catching all kinds of stuff today. <laughs> A pretty red grouper. Look at that. It's like a ruby red color almost. Look at his mouth. They're pretty. <laughs> Alright, let's let him go. There he goes. Oh, oh, Jackie's got an amberjack. Get him up here. You can get him. Come on. No, he's fine. Hold on to him. They fight hard, don't they? All right. Woo! No, the one I hooked was way bigger than that. So you want to take a picture with him? Mm-hmm. All right. Click, click. We took a picture. <laughs> All right, now we got the picture. Let's go ahead and let the amberjack go since they're out of season. 
And there he goes. He's off. There's a boat coming up on us. It's so, guys, it's so foggy out here. It's eerie. Um, we're like in a cloud right now. There's a boat coming in, and I can't even see it. I can't even see 100 feet in front of us. There's the boat right there. Yeah, it's got to be a guide rolling poles on people. I guess they heard about the ambulance, guys. All right, we're going to catch some more fish. There was so much action, we had to make this into two separate videos. But go ahead and smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave some comments down below. And make sure you hit that bell icon so you'll get notified when I release part two. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you on the water again soon.